Two twenty-eight logs are to be stacked in a store in the following manner: thirty logs in the bottom, thirty logs here, like this, thirty logs. Then twenty-eight here, thirty. Then twenty-eight. Then twenty-six, and so on. So here the city is thirty, twenty-eight, twenty-six, so on. So total two twenty-eight logs. So here the first term is like thirty, and common difference is a two minus a one, so which is twenty-eight minus thirty, which is minus two. Now total logs are two twenty-eight. So sum of all the logs is two twenty. Eight. Here they are asking like, in how many rows can these two twenty eight logs be stacked? So they are asking here n. So S N formula is n by two into two a plus n minus one into d is two twenty eight. So here n by two two a a is thirty. Plus n minus one into minus two equals two twenty eight. So here n by two two times thirty is sixty. N into minus two minus two n minus one into minus two is plus two equals two twenty eight. So n by two sixty plus two sixty two minus two n. Is two twenty eight. Now here, if we multiply sixty two n by two minus two n square by two is two twenty eight. Here two to cancel two times thirty one. So you are left with here here thirty one n. Minus n square is two twenty eight. See, this is not in a standard form, so I'll transpose these two values towards right side. So I'll get like n square minus thirty one n plus two twenty eight equals zero. Now here the coefficient of n square is one. One into two twenty eight is two twenty eight. So factors will be like two one one four. Do prime factorization, you'll get A number where you'll get like thirty-one, like two times fifty-seven, three times one, three times nine. Now see, you need thirty-one, so two into two into three, twelve, and nineteen. So two twenty-eight is nothing but twelve into nineteen. So n square minus nineteen n minus twelve n. Plus two twenty eight equals zero. So here in the first two terms, I can take n common, n minus nineteen. In the next two terms, minus twelve, n minus nineteen equals zero. So because twelve into nineteen is two twenty eight, n minus nineteen into n minus twelve equals zero. N minus nineteen equals zero. N minus twelve equals zero. So n equals nineteen. n equals 12 now here the value of n are like both are positive so which one to take so how to decide is now you find a19 a19 and a12 a19 is a plus 18d a12 is a plus 11d now see here a19 is a is 30 Plus eighteen into minus two. Thirty minus thirty-six, so minus six. So in the nineteenth row, there are minus six logs, which is not possible. So number of logs cannot be negative. So simplify this. A is thirty. Eleven into minus two. Thirty minus twenty-two, which is eight. So in the twelfth row, there are eight logs. So total, see now, number of rows nineteen is not possible. So number of rows are twelve. And how many logs are there? Here they ask the question like, 
how many logs are there in the last row so in the last row there are like eight logs 